Hi everybody, happy Sunday. It's Teresa from Baby Steps Reborn Treasures. Just coming on with a quick little video with Madison from yesterday, guys. <laughs> I try, I kept trying to record videos yesterday, so this is like a voiceover because I kept trying to put together a video yesterday and I, it just wouldn't work. So I had to end up stopping it and I took a lot of clips. So I just put them all together and decided to do a voiceover. Like right here, I'm looking at her little chest. Guys, I love that chest plate. Never had one before on a baby. I absolutely love it. But yeah, guys, it um, also I wanted to give a shout out for Bella Blessing for her tag, mini me tag. Uh, I would have to say that Madison would be my mini me because although we look nothing, absolutely nothing alike, this girl right here, <laughs> she is so cute to me and I just want to dress her and do all kind of different stuff and she's going to get a lot out of me. So I'm going to call her my mini me for the sake of the video, guys. And um, it's funny how these dolls can, I don't know, they can like trigger different sides to your emotions. It's at least in my collection, my dolls do that to me. Like my baby, my my like um Trey and and Ty and them, they they like grab grab my inner my maternal side, you know, where I just wanna cuddle and hug and snuggle and all that, you know, and cool and all that with them. And then this girl right here, her and and even um even um, Jay, well, the bond is a little different between Madison and Jay, but Madison kind of, she kind of grabs like, she pulls at my memories, you know, like my young girl memories and stuff like that, you know, like I look at her and I look at how, like how I got her hairstyle today right here on this picture. This was one of my hairstyles that I wore in my young years. And I used to put my daughter's hair up like that too. You know, just like comb it up, put it down on the side and wrap the bun around in the top or else just let it be wild up in the top. This is something like I used to wear when I was young. So as um, soon as I did her hair like that, it triggered some memories, you know. And um, I just think that, um, I don't know. I just think that I can pull back at a lot of my youthfulness with this dial right here. So I'll be, call, uh, she'll be my mini, my mini me and I'll just like put a whole lot of my own personality into her. You know, when you know how you get your dolls their own personality. I'll give this one a lot of my personality. I can see that happening. So, you know, things that, um, you know, the way I acted when I was in, in my prime and in my youthful years and stuff, you know. So, you know, we do all kind of different things with our dolls. And I guess this is just how I feel with this one. But guys, I hope you enjoyed looking at her. I know it's just the same old pose, same old picture. But like I said, I put them all together and just decided to do a voiceover. And it seemed to work because I'm still struggling trying to get back into my videos. I want to make them, but as soon as I turn the camera on, I don't have no words. So I end up turning the camera back off and waiting and coming back, turning the camera back off. It's just like the words won't come. So I don't know. Hopefully I get it back eventually. Today, um, I'm going to go out to Applebee's with my son. We're having a little um, Sunday dinner thing out to Applebee's. And I might just take Maddie with me just to see, um, you know, just for the, like the reactions and just try to get some reaction photos and stuff like that. I like to do that every now and then. And the people get to staring and wondering why she got a dial with her, you know. <laughs> Sometimes I like doing stuff like that just to get the reaction. It doesn't bother me if they look at me like I'm crazy and all that. That don't bother me at all. So if they come and talk to me, you know, I do have an excuse. I'll say, well... I, um, I'm her artist, you know, and I'll give them a card or whatever, you know, so that'll kind of, you know, help me out from, from fitting in the crazy box, you know, where people always try to judge you and say something wrong with you because you love dolls. But, you know, dolls, you know, dolls are my history. My mom loved dolls the same way I do. So uh, she always had dolls. I still have one of her older dolls right now in my collection that I got to try to see what I can do with her. But okay, guys, I'm not going to stay. The video is ending now. So thank you to any new subscribers. I see you there. And thank you to my regular supporters. I love you all. And we'll talk to you soon. Bye.